Good afternoon everyone, thank you for viewing our 1968 Pontiac GTO 400 horsepower motor. The GTO is 1968, has 106,000 miles on it, brand new tires. Um, let's get right into the meat and potatoes of everything. The car is a survivor. It is by no means a 10 out of 10. It is a great body to start. It runs and drives very well. I don't see any problems with the transmission uh, in driving it. The suspension drives straight down the road. I would drive it from here to California tomorrow if I had to. We have not noticed any type of oil leaks, any type of fluid leaks. So let's get down to the uh, meat and potatoes. As I said, the, the damage on the survivor vehicle, you got uh, up top here, weather strip missing, a little bit of paint damage right here, cracking. Uh, there's a crack, little crack here in the right fender on the hood. The hood needs to be adjusted so that it goes down into the uh, housing the way it's supposed to. There's a little bit of damage right there. You can see the, the photos. I took detailed photos of the damage bubbling here on the A post a lot of bubbling right here around this corner here I'm trying to give you guys the most 100% honest view of the vehicle so you know what you're bidding on there's some bubbling back here um, chrome on the vehicle is in outstanding condition these lights work brand new tires like I said now, the interior is immaculate uh, just put in brand new carpet. AC works great. It's got the undermount factor, uh, aftermarket AC. It blows freezing cold. Um, as you can see here on the, the dashboard, it's got a little bit of, of that factory paint that come off. Um, it's easy to, you know, if you just want to do a quickie, uh, spray paint it, or you can get the wood grain stickers like they have here to go over it. Um, it's got factory AC also. I have not tried it. We do not believe it works. That's why this unit was put in, but it has been converted to R134. Um, got all the original interior parts. There's nothing, nothing missing on the interior parts. The center console, the cap has a crack in it. Um, the lid for the center console. Uh, all the doors shut and close as they should and line up as they should. Um, let's see the interior is in great condition GT racing uh, steering wheel we have the original steering wheel in the back of the trunk of the vehicle along with the spare tire uh, we'll move to the trunk in a minute and that's the interior let me go ahead and start this puppy up here so you can hear what she sounds like Starts right up. Here's the uh, 404 motor. Uh, stickers are still on the front here, as you can see. Put a brand new battery in it. Um, power steering, power brakes, R134. There's no oil leaks or anything like that. Uh, we're going to go ahead and turn the vehicle off so I can show you the trunk real quick because we're running out of time. Uh, I'll put a separate video on there of me driving the vehicle at a, a later time. There's the original steering wheel. There's some surface rust in here. It's not uh, uh, any type of... It, it is solid. It's just uh, surface rust uh, that can be grind down and painted. And uh, other than that, it's, it's a nice vehicle. So... Look for the next video.